But what was that turning point for you after so many years in and out of knowing what you knew, you know, the streets, the gang, the the badge of honor of going in and out, you had to come to that aha moment. It's like, you know what? Like, yo, what's going to change with Cardell, man? What, what, what? I need something different. This is not working for me no more. Right, that got you to that thinking where you say, you know what? Instead of reading all these Donald Goen books and reading the Iceberg Slams and the this and the that, let me change my paradigm of how I shift and think and feed and view things to make it where it can be beneficial to my life, where I can utilize it when I get out. Uh, it, it was that. It was that. That indictment, man, seeing my name versus the United States of America, right? Uh -huh. and, and then not only that, I had, it was two fears. Well, it's really equals to one fear, Chris. I, but the thing was, I didn't, I was already 34, right? I'm first indictment. I'm already thinking I'm, I'm, I'm doing at least 10. So that's going to put me at 44 when I get out at, if I get a 10, right? So I'm thinking like, man, I don't want to die old in prison. And I don't want to be in prison and a natural disaster or a world disaster happens and I'm stuck in prison and I can't do nothing about it. And so mm -hmm. I'm like, man, at the end of the day, I just didn't want to die in prison. And I knew whenever I got out off that federal bid, any other case that I caught, because my criminal history was already so high that I was going to be under that, um, that 240 to 360 range month. And I, you know, so it was like, if you if you get it together now, you're going to end up spending the rest of your life in prison. Yeah. So the federal, that's for those that don't understand how the federal system works out there. Right? The federal system works on a point system. It's not like your regular state system where they can sentence you to, you know, sporadic times, however they want. Um, the federal system has to go through a federal guideline. Um, and there's two lines, it's a nine from, what, what is it, one to nine across and one to 33 um, vertical straight down, right? And they match those points, and that's how you get sentenced, correct? Yeah, so yeah, exactly. You got your offense so, level, and you got your criminal history level. A correct. Criminal history goes to six, and your yes. offense level goes to like 38, but you don't see the 38. They stop at 32 on the list. But they can uh -huh. go further. And wherever right. your number meets at, that line meets at, like my offense level was 27 and my criminal history was 30, was a five. So wherever they meet at, that's basically where your sentencing guideline range is. That's uh, how that system works. <laughs> exactly. 